M0FXB, welcome to my channel and my videos on the ICOM ID52. M0FXB ID52 on the waterfall scope. So here it is running at the moment and we're on single receive. So we're just on two meters. So as you tune through, you can look for activity. Now we've only got the rubber duck inside here, but if we had the external antenna, you would see the, 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 the stronger colors showing any band activity so we can try it on on 70 centimeters as well let's just come out of it let's get it onto 70 centimeters let's go from about here then you go menu then you select scope and then you can normally a bit more activity you might pick up my hotspot which is go through now we're in scroll mode you can select different modes we just had a bit of red come through there so it definitely works I mean it's not as good as the 705 of course now the different now there's something there see that now it's probably not there you are. It's probably get it into DV. It's probably like a different mode altogether. But anyway, so you've got some different selections here. If you go quick spec here, you've got scope mode, and you can choose the scroll which I'm on, fixed and center. So let's do fixed. And there is a span selection here, which I haven't really done yet. See, it's 432 to 433, which I'm sure you could change. Scope mode center. That's, I think that's probably the one, the classic sort of one that you'd be looking at. I like it in scroll mode. Now you can do dual band um, waterfall, hold it down, but you get a smaller scope. So if we go to the B band, and then go menu scope. You can have two scopes there. As you can see, I wouldn't say it's great, but that's pretty much what you get. I go single mode. That's our, our hotspot coming through. Get this. Scope mode, let's try scroll again. So it's all bright red there, it's a strong signal. See if we can change that. Let's try fixed. No, such a strong signal. Center. Well, you got the DPS coming through there from JA to SYJ. Just select to back out of that. Let's get it into my memory channel. This is my all star. Now you do need to be running version 1.20 firmware for the scope to be included. This radio came version 1.10 and I have made a video on upgrading the firmware. So when you select quick, then you also can select single sweep. Go back with the menu button or continuous sweep. So I'm quite new to it myself. Which is on about. We go menu set. Scroll right down to the bottom and click others and information, and then you'll get your version. You need 1.20 for scope. So yeah, it's great fun, and um, the, you know this. The other thing about this radio, it will do simultaneous, simultaneous digital receive, which is uh, I've never seen before. So we just need to get it into DR mode on on the A band. Then we've got our open spot. 
on the A band, on reflector 30, and reflector 1 Charlie on the bottom at simultaneous receive. So 7-3, all the best. Thanks very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you find it helpful, please hit that like button and subscribe. 7-3, all the best.